So mm, the, lud the lud lunacy continues. This is my favorite right here. Well, actually, it's it's kind of a tie. The XL Al expert. <laughs> Iran likely involved, of course, because you got to have that space because the tree of life is sitting there, isn't it? That's where you think it's going to show up in three years. So you got to drag us back into a war, right? I love this. XL. Yeah. What is that? Isn't it the. Um, Oh, I believe it's the, let's just erase this right here for a minute, because, so let's get rid of this, let's see, profile, experts believe the plane is intact, but we want to get rid of this right here, let's just get rid of that, and let's just work this out here, what this is really saying, so it's really, X L A I expert. So it's X L. This is hilarious. And of course, you know, the same two looking dumb guys from 9 11, right? Same thing, walking through with fake passports. Remember when we all bought that story for about a week? <laughs> Let's move on to this one. Look, it deviated 330 degrees on a heading of 024. <gasps> There's your six. And this one, this one, this one's great. Look at this. Yep, this one's more plausible. Because I'm pretty sure that's the reality. I keep telling you guys it's something. Something that's nuclear based, this whole Elohim thing. But so we look at that. Wait, I got one more of of the four that I put up here. This is the most believable. Is it's completely insane, but it's no more insane than the shit that I just showed you. I mean, for fuck's sake, Israeli Times, give me a fucking break. How ludicrous. They probably fucking think probably is on a fucking moon. <laughs> and of course they put it on one of these nut papers. Whatever. I just thought you guys were going to chuckle out of this.